Hello everyone, you're in Endurance Laser Lab. In this video, we're going to show you a live demo of laser engraving using 30 watt Endurance triple beam laser. So we're going to engrave on anodized materials like aluminum. So Boris already put a heatsink, black heatsink, and now we're going to engrave. The good thing that now you can do it really, really quickly. So the speed is 50, so it's uh, for 10 watt you probably needed to use something like 10 15 but here is 50 so it's much quite fast and the uh, quality of line of laser engraving is quite accurate but you need to set up focus and the position quite well okay let's show us what we have here okay so you see the star looks nice okay uh, let's try another material. Okay, let's take blue uh, plate. So now we need to change a focal range between the laser and the surface. So you see three spots. So now we are going to move down. And you'll see that these all three spots will combine in one. Okay. So uh, keep in mind that uh, all uh, 30 watt laser is equipped with triple laser boxes. Okay, and uh, so you can measure incoming voltage, outgoing voltage. Okay, now we're in focus and we can start. So uh, to set up uh, low, no, we are getting out. Okay, so you see that Boris is setting up. So he uses a uh, software called Kura. So we set up uh, different power for the uh, fan. Okay, I'm going to add a filter. So you see that it's it's small line. Looks like it's small. Okay, let's start and see what we get at the end. We're also not used for it at the moment. Okay, I'm going to change uh, parameters of my camera. So you see that it's really, really powerful. Yeah, probably we didn't uh, make a perfect focus. Maybe we did. We'll see when we got it. Okay. Okay, so you see the star, looks good. Okay, let's try a uh, red one. So, we already made it a few experiments before shooting this video. So that should, should work. Okay. Yeah, that spot is quite small. Okay. So, we use regular lens here, uh, not G2, but regular lens, so you see the spot is small. Okay, let's, let's engrave. Maximum power. So like I said, in a software, in a slicer, you can change a fan parameter, so we connect it to an F2 fan output, so uh, you can set up 1% power and 100% power. So now it's full power. And once again, let's see what we have here. Oh, yes. Okay. Okay, another star. And let's make uh, another attempt on this laser uh, with single laser. One again laser. So with the black it will work. Now we are setting up just one laser. So Boris is going to turn off both lasers. So we have one. Just to make sure that you'll see the difference uh, when just one laser is engraving. That uh, 30 watt 
can do it much much faster so that you'll be able to see the difference it does also pretty good but uh, like I said three beams are much much better but it show us the result So you see that uh, it's not as bright as this one. So this one we made last time and this one was uh, initial. So you see the difference. So uh, we'll keep exploring our 30 watt triple beam laser and hope that you like this video. Please share it with your friends and hope that you'll enjoy our 30 watt triple beam 445 nanometer endurance laser. Bye bye.